caught him on his way to Stanleyville and flew him back. Patrice Lumumba securely wrote. And with him were men who served in his cabinet when he was prime minister. They were bundled into a heavily guarded lorry and driven off towards a place called Binza. Lumumba had been under house arrest, protected by UN troops in Leopoldville, when he escaped. His recapture was quite a triumph for Colonel Mobutu, who now saw his enemy arrive. Lumumba's bonds are tightened. They were taking no chances. And his wife and child watch his humiliation. The whole affair, of course, serves to underline once again the conditions prevailing in the Congo. It's not enough to arrest a man. He must apparently be beaten up as well, then put him on trial later, no doubt. As for Mobutu's troops, they yelled and danced with joy. They had won a great victory. They had got Lumumba after trying to lay their hands on him for months. The leader of